just had to train legs today. My favorite body part, legs, hamstrings, calves, glutes, hip flexors, the whole thing. After I got out of office, I taught at Harvard, and I taught in the John F. Kennedy School of Government. One of my classes was how pro wrestling prepares you for politics, and everybody chuckled when they heard it. <laughs> pro wrestling teaches you, okay, my job as a villain was to piss people off so bad they would spend their hard-earned money to come and see me get beat. Well, what's the difference between that and asking them for a vote? In fact, voting's easier. It doesn't hit their wallet. Second, when you're in a match, Murphy's Law always shows up. Anything that can go wrong will. You have to be able to think on your feet. You have to be able to keep this match operating to the entertainment level it has to be at for the wrestling fan. So in politics, you're going to get questions, as Gary Johnson did, you're not maybe prepared for at the moment. So you've got to be able to think on your feet quickly, just like wrestling. Finally, you're comfortable in front of a mic, in front of a TV camera. You communicate. It's about communication, and you have to have that in wrestling. They used to say the money's made at the mic, not in the ring. That used to be an old saying. You make your money on the microphone, not the ring. All of those things come together, truly prepare you for a life of going after an elected office. Harvard will teach you the theory of government. Harvard's smart enough to bring me in and teach you the reality of government. <laughs>